welcome to my youtube channel so please before you continue to watch this video don't forget to hit the subscribe button by subscribing to my channel so i'm going to discuss with you how to schedule a meeting using zoom so we're going to do that actually using the zoom application software and also using the zoom in microsoft outlook so let's say you want to schedule a meeting with your colleague and um, in your um, office or you want to schedule a zoom meeting with someone with a friend and you've installed zoom on your device you've created a free account and you've installed the zoom software on your device so here we have the option is zoom when you open zoom for the first time you will soon you will see we have some different options to actually schedule a meeting so we can actually join a meeting in which someone invites us so we can here enter the meeting id and here's the name and we can join we can as well select do not connect to audio we can as well schedule a meeting ourselves so here we have the option to actually give the the, the topic a name a befitting name because zoom is going to schedule um select one for you but you can as well schedule the meeting and just give the meeting a name let me just call this ict meeting so we can actually select the date we want to schedule the meeting we can as well select a time frame for the meeting we can say okay this meeting is going to be a recurrent meeting it's going to be every day or we can as well decide to say no we just want to actually do a one-time meeting so here we have the security the pass passcode that will be used for this meeting and if the video will be on or on or off and the user will be requested to actually put on the video himself or we can as well schedule this in our calendar in google calendar or in others so we have the advanced option as well which we can decide to allow participants to join this meeting we can mute participants upon entry because when some people join the meeting they may never knew they may have some music on the background so you can mute the participant upon entry and we can as well automatically record meeting on the local device so let me click cancel and go to my outlook so in outlook if for example i want to schedule a new meeting so i have the option to actually here we have the option to schedule the meeting schedule the meeting or we can actually start start a um, an instant meeting start without a video or we can start with a video so but if i go to my calendar let me just go to my calendar here and here on my calendar i can create a new appointment actually so let me say if i try to create a new appointment i can create a new appointment here and by creating a new appointment i can decide to schedule a meeting so if i say for example the appointment the start time of the appointment is going to be let me just select a different day um on the third of november and i'll say the appointment time is going to be like let me just say um boop, 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 boop. let me select 10 a.m and the end date is going to be the same so i'm just going to actually see if i can schedule the, let me just try to show the meeting you can see we're going to add a zoom scheduler here and uh, let me see uh, generate automatically the meeting id will be generated automatically or i can personalize the meeting id by using this id so i can let me just use the um automatically generated meeting id and here we'll have the passcode which will be generated for us as well so the video i can as well use the computer audio for this meeting click on the advanced options we can allow participants to join at any time as well let me just click save and you can see the meeting has been joined so right now i'm going to also actually request because see we don't have the option here to actually send this to users but i'm going to request some users to join this meeting for example i can say simon johnson and mercy robot so let me just click cancel i can just then i click send okay so the meeting is being created on my calendar and it will be sent to simon and mercy so if i go back to my main and look and here and i click schedule a meeting when i click schedule a meeting um you can see i came up also with the same um options just i just I, just as i did from my calendar so here i can as well select the same thing and click let me just click save you can see we have the meeting is being scheduled as well so the user will actually need to click on this link to join the meeting automatically and the meeting id is going to be 
this and here is going to be the passcode that will be used to join the meeting so i will be required like let me just require thomas vicent for this meeting and can decide to choose a date as well for this meeting and click send the meeting has been sent so let me go back to the computer of mercy to mercy you can see that mercy i just received a notification that i want to schedule a meeting with him you can see that as well. I can see how many people is going to join this meeting. This is Simon James and Mercy Robert has been invited to join this meeting as well. So if I go back to my computer here and I click, let me just go here and I decide to go to my calendar and I let me go to next week. So you can see that I've already scheduled a meeting for next week Tuesday. If I double click this meeting and I try to click on this link. So it says I should click on open Zoom meeting on the dialog shown by your browser. But if you don't see that, you can just click on launch meeting to launch the meeting right now. You can see that the meeting is being launched. So right now I can let me join with the computer audio as well. So you can see that right now I'm the only one in this meeting. So if I go to the computer of Mercy, I can decide to accept. Let me accept this request of me and then go back again to the calendar. And go back to next week tuesday and here we can see that messi has the invitation on his calendar so when i open and i can decide to join this meeting as well so it's telling me that i should launch to actually join the meeting so and i will um, please wait the meeting host will let you in. So if I go back again to my computer, you can see that Mercy um, is being waited. So it says Mercy enter the waiting room, please admit. So I just click admit. And right now you can see that Mercy have joined the meeting and here we have two participants who is on the meeting. So you can decide to share your screen as well by sharing your screen and you can share a whiteboard. Let me just share. If I share my whiteboard and I go back to Messi's computer, you can see that Messi is now seeing everything Kelvin is sharing. So that is how you actually create um, a meeting or join a meeting in Zoom. My name is Kelvin Johnson. Please, if this video has been of any help to you, don't forget to like my, my channel, subscribe to my channel, like my video, leave a comment or send me an email and I'll reply to you as quick as possible. Thank you very much and see you next time. Bye.